is Miss Dorothy. Go see Emily. Where is she? Where is she? Good turn. Okay, off you go. The idea of this program is to encourage you to use your eyes, and sometimes your ears, in picking out abnormalities in the way children walk. Of course, diagnosis needs a full history, examination and investigation. But you can often get the first clues simply from watching the way children walk into your consulting room. There may be special points about the way each leg is raised and set down. Before you start this observation test for yourself, here are a few hints to help you. Do the heels touch the ground first, or the forefoot? There will be toe walking if the ankle won't dorsiflex. Is the foot in a valgus position, as here, or in varus? Look at the calcaneus. Here it's deviated laterally. It's easy to hear one foot slapping the floor, but in this case it's the normal foot. Here is pronounced knock knee with separation of the malleoli. The knees are hyperextended and the hips are laterally rotated. Both these boys suffer from the same muscle disease and the clue for it is in the way they walk. Can you go back again, nice and slow? Watch the waddling gait once more. Here you can see muscle wasting. And don't just look at the legs, look above the hips as well. Is there a clue in the arm that doesn't swing? Or in the peculiar position of the hand?